Us South Carolinians know it well. In fact, they teach it in schools. Brady has learned it. We are talking about our state dance. I know you know it's the shag. So News 19's Rachel Ripp shares the history of the dance and shows us a few dance moves herself. Let's check this out. We can come toward each other as I bring her in, and we can go away from each other as I send her out, and we finish with a rock step. Shagging. The dance all South Carolinians know and love. There's some history behind the rhythm too. This was our form of doing swing dance, but since it was born on the beach, there was more of a shuffling action with the feet instead of picking the steps up and down, which would of course kick sand all over your partner. Blue Moon Ballroom here in West Columbia helps you get a groove to your feet. And Jim Williamson, the owner and an instructor here, says the dance originally was a way for men to show off their skills when trying to impress a woman. Nowadays, both partners get to show off. And everyone young and old from any background or walk of life can get down to a good beat. It's a very important part of tying the community together because it gives everyone a chance to do something that you don't require very special skills for. If anybody can walk, they can dance. The washing machine and belly roll are for those with a little more experience. And right now in Myrtle Beach, the capital of Shag, you can catch shaggers from all across the state at the fall migration, a 10-day event. I, of course, had to try it for myself. This is me learning the basic. There's tradition and fun in the footwork. Everyone loves a good beat from the beach music that you've heard over the years, and so it just kind of makes you motivated to get up and get on your feet. Reporting in West Columbia, Rachel Ripp, News 19, WLTX. Okay now, I love the shag. I was count as a former dancer, I was counting those steps. One, two, three, one, two, three, rock back. There you got it, Rachel. You did great. Um, the Studio in West Columbia has an open shag dance every Friday night at 730. If you want to learn a few of those moves yourself, just in case you didn't learn it in school. I love that. 730 on Friday night. 730 on Friday. Let's you go. Know, you you be my dance partner. I mean, at this point, 7.30 on Friday night, like 20 years ago, I might have started getting ready for the club. Oh, that's right. 7.30 on Friday night, now I need to be on my way back home it's late. from the club. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but that looks or, like it could be fun. Or 